What's going on hikers? In today's video, we're talking insects and how to keep those things at bay. If you're new to the channel, my name is Jeremiah Stringer and here we talk about all things hiking and backpacking. We do info, tips, tricks, hacks, we explore all that stuff. So if you're into backpacking just like me, make sure you subscribe below to get some more content. With the bugs out in full force, you got ticks, you got turkey mites, you got mosquitoes. I mean, it's backpacking season, baby. I thought, what a great time to get rid of all this stuff and help you guys out. I got five things that you can use to help avoid and get rid of insects. Number one on my list, permethrin. Permethrin, I treated all my gear before doing my through hike of the long trail with permethrin. I treated my pants, my socks, my shirt, uh, my backpack, all my stuff, and guess how many ticks I had to pull off of me? Zero. Now this stuff is great. If uh, you want to check out any of this stuff I'm going to talk about today, I'll link it in the description below and you can read more about it, or if you want to buy some, you can. Uh, I know it's chemicals, but if you want to uh, keep the mosquitoes and all those other insects at bay, uh, you're probably going to have to use something, whether it's natural or not. Number two, DEET, 100% DEET, or if that's not your thing, you can get something that's less, you can get DEET free bug spray, but um, if you don't treat with permethrin, I would highly suggest, or if you wanna double down, use 100% DEET. Number three, even if you do everything on my list today, you probably will at some point get in bites from some type of bug. So make sure this backpacking season, you bring some kind of itch stopping cream. I use Benadryl and I use this throughout my through hike. Um, if I got any mosquito bites, you just take you know a little bit and dab it on there and voila, no more itching. Number four, clothing. We need to talk about clothing. Let's take a minute, okay? If you've watched my exploring videos, you probably notice I'm always wearing the same clothes. And you're like, why is this guy wearing the same clothes every time I watch him? Okay, if you haven't watched the exploring videos, make sure you go watch them. Okay, the reason I've selected the clothes I have is they have a purpose for me. Okay, my shirt, let's talk about it first. I wear, typically while I'm hiking, a Performance Fishing Gear Columbia shirt. And it is long sleeve. Year round, I'm wearing long sleeve. And you're like, what the heck? Why is he wearing long sleeves? Okay, if you want to, you can pull them up. But I actually keep them pulled down. Because purpose one is I want to keep the sun off of me. I know this video isn't about that. But... I burn really easily because my skin tone is the underside of a fish. Okay, I'm really pale. But two is bugs. Okay, I wear long sleeves because mosquitoes and biting flies, freaking biting flies, I swear, Vermont. We went in black fly season. So if you live somewhere where there's biting flies, wearing long sleeves can help protect your skin. And also if you're dealing with mosquitoes, the less area you have exposed on your skin, the less area they can bite. My pants, let's talk about my pants. So most of the time I like hiking in shorts even in the winter, but if I wanna keep the bugs off of my legs, I'll wear convertible shorts slash pants. So if I get to camp and I'm dealing with mosquitoes cause I'm not moving and they're like biting me all up, I will actually put the pant legs back on my pants and they unzip and zip at the knee and then I convert my shorts back into pants. So if you all wanna check out the clothing that I have, you can watch those videos and I'll also link in the description the, the actual clothes that I bought. Number five, a bug head net. If you've never used one of these before, they can be a lifesaver. I bought that head net at Walmart for like $1.98. Super cheap, inexpensive. Um, a little hack I'll give you is, you can see I'm wearing a baseball cap. If you use a baseball cap with your head net, the net won't be touching your face and you know won't be aggravating you. Now, I had to use it because of black flies, but they'll also save your face and neck from mosquitoes because you don't want that lovely face to be getting eaten up. Question of the day. I want you to comment below and tell me what are some other tips and tricks that I could use to help avoid getting eaten alive by all these bugs while I'm backpacking. If you've enjoyed, make sure you smash that like button, subscribe for more content, and kick the notification bell for the latest notifications. We'll see you in the next video. <laughs>